In his lecture titled Plants Are Trying to Kill You, carnivore doctor Anthony Chafee claims that seed oils can function as immunosuppressants, and when they were used as immunosuppressants in kidney transplant patients, they ended up causing cancer. They actually found that seed oils were a very good immunosuppressant, and they were saying this works great for people that are getting a kidney transplant, they're not rejecting their kidneys. The problem was they were all getting cancer, and so they had to stop that. There was only one reference listed in the video pertaining to that claim, and it's a blog post. And the blog author does state that kidney transplant patients were fed sunflower seed oil for its immunosuppressant properties, but that the transplant doctors were then astonished to see how quickly their patients developed cancers, and the treatment was stopped. So let's dive into the actual reference that's provided within the blog. There is a case series of 10 transplant patients who were fed 10 milliliters of sunflower seed oil three times a day in addition to immunosuppressant medication. So the seed oil wasn't meant to be the sole immunosuppressant, this was consumed in addition to immunosuppressant medications. And of the 10 patients, three died post-operatively, one died seven months later from hepatitis, but their kidney function was considered excellent, and the other six were living with functional grafts and there were no complications. In fact, the authors explicitly state that the seed oils were well tolerated and that there were no side effects attributed to the oils. And there was not a single mention of cancer or the trial being ended early despite Chafee and the blog author claiming so. Now this is a small, uncontrolled trial, so I wouldn't draw any firm conclusions from it, but why are they making strong and seemingly fabricated claims? Well, I can't say for certain, but I suspect that Chafee just repeated what he read in the blog without checking the primary sources, and the blog author is either lying or is extremely confused. 